What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Bang Shinoi Fumi. Today, we're back in the video, man. Today, I'm reacting to Paternity Court, and I'm reacting to the best fights in Paternity Court, man. You know how we get down in Paternity Court. You feel me? It's been a fat minute since so I don't react to Paternity Court, so I'm finna get lit today, man. Make sure you like, you comment, you share, and you subscribe to the channel, man. It's your boy, B2S. Let's get straight to it, y'all. I'm excited as hell, man. I haven't done a reaction to Paternity Court in years, cuz. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> That's all no, fake. You are she is fake. not like that. That is all fake. No, no you, that doesn't make sense though. I'm his baby mother and I have to talk to him. Not you. I didn't make no baby with you. It don't matter. Damn. 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 If that's the case, if you was looking out for me, why didn't you tell me? How come I had to find out for somebody else? Hey, bro, don't tell you like this. You know, it happens like that sometimes. Why do you tell me? Why are you calling me like that? The 31-year-old woman looks for her father and hopes a DNA test would help her in her search. You say you met the defendant, Mr. Jordan, in a courthouse when you were seven years old, yes. and he was taken to court for child support. Yeah. You claim he denied paternity testing at that time and claimed you as his daughter and began paying child support. Yeah. But since that time, he has denied you and refused to treat you like his daughter. She was asked by the judge why it is important for her to find her father. I came here to see if he is my biological father because I lost my mother a year ago from breast cancer. Damn. I want to fill that void. I don't have no one else. It's just Damn. Me. And I just want to make sure that he is my father. And I, I just want closure. I right. Understand. The person she claims could be her father had earlier been in her life when she was seven years old. And I immediately raised my hand and said, hey, that's okay. We don't need a um, paternity test. And I told her, I'd say, I'm your daddy, baby, right here. And I took on that responsibility, okay? And I paid her mama $400 a and month. And she was seven years old. She was seven or eight. A mom wanted me to adopt her did he ever have doubts i've Miss always had doubts man. see listen man listen first of all i'm sorry to cut it short but what i'm trying to tell y'all is but this guy not realize he's talking about a human being bro like even if that's not your kid that's a human being that's a little human being bro that's a little being bro it's a being it's a person bro like you talking about you talking about a person that is potentially yours you know what i'm saying as well you know what I'm saying? From your family, from your DNA, as if it's some object, bro. That's not right, bro. No matter what, it's not right, bro. Like, the way he's talking, his whole demeanor, the arrogance and all that, you know what I'm saying? It, it's insane, bro. Yeah, but there was nothing I could do about it. He never tried to be with I had accepted the fact that uh, I had a one-night affair, bit bam, thank you, man, with her mom one time. And after that, I never saw thank her. Miss Mitchell was not buying that. You say... You did your best to try to establish a relationship. Yes. All the way he up to He never tried to establish a relationship. He never even tried to call me. You claim you tried to call him daddy once. Yes, I did. And what happened? He told me to call him Jordan. Is mm -hmm. that true, Mr. Jordan? I tell everyone to call me Jordan. Mm -hmm. Except her. Mm -hmm. so that's <laughs> your daughter. Your daughter. Well, I raised this one. Here's what he had to say about his doubts. I didn't find out about her until she was eight years old, okay? I never had a relationship with her mom, period, ever, other than, like I say, in the so back. Oh, that's your daughter, my boy. Like Look at the nose, exactly. bro. Surprisingly, Miss Mitchell has doubts, too. Talk to me about your dogs. For one, I don't look nothing like them. Hello? They Amazons. Me? I'm short. <laughs> I'm only 4'8". They up there around 6'2 or something like that. Then secondly, my birth certificate don't even have his name at all. It's time to hear from Mr. Jordan's witness. Oh, my God. Now, this is your daughter, Ms. Wagner. Yes. This is my father, and he gonna do what he have to do until I die or he die. <laughs> Woo! Okay. Maybe I'm Looks like she's kid, feisty. Bro. She talked about a relationship with her father. He is right. He do do stuff for me. He has always been there for me since day one, and he's gonna be there for me. I didn't ask. He is the parent. I am not the parent. I think he's scared not to. <laughs> <laughs> when asked how she regarded Miss Mitchell when growing up, everything went downhill from her answer. Um, I'm the first one, so okay. of course. Of course, she always thinks she's first. I am the first one. We don't know nobody else. Don't whatever. Girl, stop whatever. 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 This is fake right here all this crap <laughs> that's all no, fake what you are she is, is not like that that is all fake no do no, you girl, girl stop playing you gonna do what i tell you do because i'm fake she also revealed that miss mitchell disrespects her father so it's i'm at her house when she comes when daddy come over there she called him a punk you know what i'm saying so of course i'm she not going to disrespect she is very my father yes you are you are you call him a punk you don't care if he take care of or not it's time for the results now i don't believe her maybe maybe it's true Maybe that ain't, that ain't that ain't his kid, bro. You are not the father. You are her father. 
A man refuses paternity, and his reasons are because of his wife. Ms. Moore, you say there is only one reason the defendant, Mr. Butler, has doubts he fathered your one-year-old daughter, and that's because of his manipulating wife. Yes, Your Honor. Mr. Butler, you argue you've been told on multiple occasions by the plaintiff herself that you are not her child's father. Yes, Your Honor. He has not been present in the child's life, and Ms. Moore doesn't consider diapers and wipes a form of presence. If you're talking about diapers and wipes, that's it. That's not that's not a father to me at all, period. Only diapers and wipes. That's it. What is the cause of Mr. Butler's doubts? Oh, that is your so not the baby daddy. So Boy, so you look just like the kid, bro. You look just like the kid, bro. You look just like the kid, bro. He can't say no. that conversation happen? It's happened because she told me I'm not the dad. She told me I'm not the father. Why would she tell you that? The baby don't even look like me. <laughs> no. Your wife is jumping out of her chair. I guess she knows the story better oh, than you do. It's time to hear from the wife. Your husband says he was told by Ms. Moore he was not the father Yana, of the uh, child. Yana, on numerous times. Really harassment? harassment. I ain't never you harassed you so again. Whatever. 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 That part. Your Honor, that I was part. getting my hair That done. part. I was getting my hair done at one particular time when she was on the phone. He had her on speaker and she told him, you're not the dad. You don't have to do nothing for this baby. She had proof to back up her claims. She said her and her husband, her husband does a good job of Fiance, taking care. Fiance, and he do. No, and he that's, do. that's a text and he that do. was sent and he do. to me. He yeah. trusts that. This evidence that's been presented says from Miss Carter, my husband do a good job keeping me and his, his baby. baby. Exactly. Good. Apart from the text, she also had doubts because of this. Personally, Your Honor, it doesn't, if to me, I believe that the conception dates are all wrong because how can you tell somebody they pregnant in December, but you have the baby in July? They got the judge furious with their fights. Always two women going at it over some silent, not the same man. Back and forth. But judge, that legal to say? Listen, listen, listen. But what we are going to do as ladies is degrade ourselves act the fool up in here and we're not going to be disrespectful and use disrespectful language judge lauren went on to ask her to explain the conception because if you told him in december that you were pregnant your baby would have been born in september because my daughter is september 22nd explain to me why is she wrong when i got pregnant i had left quincy was doing so much cheating his last two babies and my baby and his last baby is two weeks apart. I had two dates, July 26th or August 5th. I had an okay, so week session on July 26th. Lord. She complained about not being able to talk to him because of his meddling wife. Always if I call Quincy, it's always her, 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 her. Because and I feel I'm his like wife and I don't one, care. One, one, one. That, that doesn't make sense though. I'm his baby mother and I have to talk right. to him. It's time for the results. In the case of Moore. That's your Butler, baby, man. That look, the baby look just like him. Tomorrow more. It has been determined by this court. That's your kid, Mr. bro. Butler, that's your you kid. Are her father. You, you Check out what Miss Moore did next. They look alike, bro. Completed everything today. This man Brother. doesn't know if the child belongs to him or his ex best friend. Oh, you thought you had found the woman of your dreams and were thrilled to find out you were having your first child with her. Mattered when you discovered she had sex with your best friend and he could be the biological father. Oh my god, bro. I wish that upon no Here's one. Here's what bro. attracted him to her personality. I really was intrigued by her energy. Uh, she's like Why so quiet, party, huh? But her mind is what captured my heart. He had doubts, and here's his reason. Eight months into the pregnancy, I get a phone call from my cousin. She she got something to tell me, but she didn't know how to tell me because it was going to hurt her feelings. What? She had a conversation with Jimmy, and then Jimmy admitted to her that she slept with Janine. Mr. Dudley. Yeah. Not only that, she seen her in the club. This is stuff I didn't. Here's what happened when he confronted her. When you... She admitted that she slept with Janine. And guess what? She also admitted that she don't know if the baby is mine. What yeah. in the world? You sleep with his best friend? I'm blaming on the alcohol. When he accused her of partying too much, here's what she had to say. You know how it was before. Don't come up in the courtroom acting like this. Bro, listen, bro, listen. That's so disrespectful. No, you're going to say I blame on alcohol. Oh, my God, bro. You a grown woman, bro. You a grown woman talking about, oh, I blame on alcohol. 
You ain't 16. You ain't pushing. You ain't pushing 17. You ain't pushing 21. You at least pushing. You know what I'm saying? Above. You know what I'm talking about. You talking about? Oh, I blame my alcohol. Man, you too childish, bro. A lot of people they be grown, but they not grown mentally, bro. She be thinking like she's 14 or something, bro. Talking about, I blame it on the alcohol. So disrespectful, man. You got no self respect, huh? Oh my goodness. This is so sad to see, man. This ain't nothing brand new, y'all. So look, Miss Woods, you said you had 11 kids. Yes. And now you claiming that just at 43 years old, you get an opportunity to have a good time. It seems like you've been having a good time for a long hey. time. It's time to meet the best friend. What do you have to add to this? Yanni, he ain't got nothing right. to add to it. You know why? Because he only lasts one minute, so. Let him, hey, he let him speak. Let him speak. <laughs> Yo, listen, listen. First of all, how you gonna get owned like that, bro? How you gonna get owned like that, bro? This, this man, this man right here is the dumbest man in the courtroom right now. I'm not going front, bro. He the dumbest man in the courtroom, cuz. He is the dumbest man in the courtroom right now, bro. This brother right here, bro. This man a fool. First of all, she gonna disrespect him. Plus, he disrespected himself by putting himself in that position. You know what I'm saying? Let her act crazy. So don't tell me. Him himself, you gotta blame on alcohol too. You, man, this guy's a disloyal friend, bro. This type of people right here, bro. Keep those people around. Like people, people, people I can't even speak English. I'm so frustrated right now, bro. These type of people, bro. I swear, bro. Never keep type of people around you, bro. If you suspect someone acting weird like that, you know what I'm saying. You have the right to question them. You know what I'm saying. And kind of keep your distance because this right here, bro. This is insane, bro. Imagine your friend just backstabbing you like that, bro. That ain't your friend no more. That ain't no friend. That's not your people. Your people are supposed to be like family to you, man. And you're going to do something like that? You're going to trick them around with your... Nah, nah, This ain't nothing brand new, y'all. So, look, Ms. Woods, you said you had 11 kids. Yes. And now you claiming that just at 43 years old, you get an opportunity to have a good time. It seems like you've been having a good time for a long hey, time. It's time to meet the best friend. What do you have to add to this? Y'all, he ain't got nothing right. to add to it. You know why? Because he only lasts one minute, so... Let him, hey, let him speak. Let him speak. Miss Wood, <laughs> let's keep our conversation related to... Look at this, <laughs> look at this nigga, man. Uh, he stated that his intention from coming was to apologize. Oh, he has I don't think he was buying that. He has the I face really of a crook, man. I really want to apologize to my best friend. We've been friends for like 10 years. Okay. I just try to look out for him, make sure he... Yeah, brother, you, you looking got, out for me? Yeah, brother, you, got, you, looking out for you me? got a little slip. So like, this is a slip right here, bro. If, that's he, case, if you was looking out for me, why didn't you tell me? How come I had to find out for somebody else? Here's his reason for not being able to tell him. I could just come to you and just, you know, and tell you that right off the muscle. You know what I'm saying? Because I knew how into it you were. You ain't, never, you ain't got no kids, and I know how it is. You understand what I'm saying? So I didn't want to just come at you like that. You know what I'm saying? So I don't think that will make it any better. When was you going to let me know 15 years later? Hey, 18, 20 years later? What if it's your child, bro? And you got me out here trying to take child. care of this child. The fight gets crazier. How you going to expose me? You didn't want to expose me, baby. You want to sleep with me like everybody else. I mean, you were looking yeah. good that night. You know what I'm saying? You look I nice was. and everything, but that wasn't what I was, I was trying to do. You know what it was? You can stand to see me. So come along. You got to let them too. You want to break us up. Man, down you want like better that. than you, son. All right, let's get some more. It's time for the results. When it comes to two-year-old Trinity Wood, Mr. Dudley, you are not her father. Oh. Moving on. Come on. Come on. Oh. When it comes to oh. two-year-old oh. Trinity Wood, oh. Mr. Baker, you are not. God just blessed you, my brother. God just blessed you, bro. Hey, 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 my brother, if you watching this, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. You told me people might be watching my videos. I don't know. I got to watch my mouth. But... Bro, listen, bro. God just blessed you, bro. Take that advantage and run away, bro. You young, bro. God bless you. Go chase your dreams, bro. Anyways, y'all, if you made this far, I appreciate it. Much love to y'all, man. It's your boy, Bang Sun. If you make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe to new channel, man. We're going to win 100K, man. You know how we get down, y'all. <laughs> paternity court, man. I've racked up paternity court in so long, bro. It'll be hard to react to paternity court. I'm not going to lie to y'all, bro. But anyways, y'all, we want to win 100K. You know what I'm saying? Let's get it popping, man.